Channing Tatum and Scarlett Johansson are making headlines with their new film, Fly Me to the Moon. The romantic comedy set during the 1960s space race features Tatum as Cole Davis, a NASA director, and Johansson as Kelly Jones, a marketing specialist tasked with boosting NASA's public image. The film explores the relationship between these two characters as they navigate the pressures of the Apollo 11 mission and the potential need to stage a fake moon landing. Channing Tatum shared some amusing anecdotes about working with Scarlett Johansson, particularly recalling their first meeting during a table read. He humorously recounted how he teased Johansson about her wig, setting a playful tone for their on-screen chemistry. Johansson, in turn, praised Tatum's humility and ability to laugh at himself, qualities that she believes are integral to his character in the film. Johansson also highlighted the unique dynamic between Tatum and his fiancée, Zoe Kravitz, describing them as the hottest couple she has ever seen. Their relationship, though rarely discussed in the media, is marked by a deep connection and mutual respect, which Johansson admires. Tatum's affection for Kravitz was evident when he was caught following multiple fan accounts dedicated to her on Instagram, an act he later described as having no chill. The film's production included some remarkable experiences for the cast, such as filming at NASA's Kennedy Space Center. Tatum and his co-stars had the opportunity to witness actual rocket launches and interact with engineers who worked on the Apollo missions. This added a layer of authenticity and excitement to the project, enriching the actors' performances. Johansson and Tatum's off-screen camaraderie translated well into their roles, creating a believable and engaging romantic dynamic. Johansson's real-life husband, Colin Jost, even made a cameo in the film, adding to the fun and light-hearted atmosphere on set. Jost and Johansson's playful interactions provided an additional layer of entertainment for the cast and crew. The film's director, Greg Berlanti, praised the instant chemistry between Tatum and Johansson, which he believes is a key element of the movie's appeal. Berlanti's vision for the film was to capture the spirit of the 1960s while delivering a fresh and original story. Johansson, who also served as a producer, expressed her hope that audiences will appreciate the film's originality and leave the theater feeling inspired. The premiere of Fly Me to the Moon was a star-studded event, with notable attendees including Neil deGrasse Tyson, Constance Wu, and Keegan-Michael Key. The film's release has generated significant buzz, with fans eager to see the on-screen pairing of Tatum and Johansson for the first time. As for the behind-the-scenes moments, Tatum's pranks and jokes kept the atmosphere lively, fostering a sense of camaraderie among the cast. Johansson's ability to balance her roles as an actress and producer showcased her versatility and dedication to the project. The film's blend of historical context and romantic comedy elements promises to offer something for everyone. Fly Me to the Moon is set to hit theaters on July 12th, and the anticipation is palpable. The film not only showcases the talents of its lead actors, but also highlights the collaborative efforts of a dedicated team. With its unique premise and stellar cast, the movie is poised to be a summer hit. Johansson's reflections on working with Tatum underscore the respect and admiration they have for each other, both professionally and personally. Their mutual appreciation is evident in their performances, adding depth to their characters' relationship. The film's light-hearted moments, combined with its historical backdrop, make for an engaging and entertaining viewing experience. As fans prepare to see Fly Me to the Moon, 
they can look forward to a film that blends humor, romance, and a touch of nostalgia. The chemistry between Tatum and Johansson is sure to captivate audiences, while the film's unique storyline offers a fresh take on the romantic comedy genre. Questions and Answers What is the premise of Fly Me to the Moon? The film is set during the 1960s space race and follows the relationship between a NASA director and a marketing specialist who must stage a fake moon landing in case the actual mission fails. How did Channing Tatum and Scarlett Johansson first meet for this film? They first met at a table read for the movie, where Tatum immediately started making fun of Johansson's wig. What does Scarlett Johansson admire about Channing Tatum's acting style? Johansson admires Tatum's humility, ability to laugh at himself, and his professional demeanor, which she believes are integral to his character in the film. What unique experience did the cast have during the film's production? The cast had the opportunity to film at NASA's Kennedy Space Center and witness actual rocket launches. Who makes a cameo appearance in the film? Scarlett Johansson's husband, Colin Jost, makes a cameo appearance in the movie. What qualities does Johansson believe make Tatum and Zoe Kravitz a great couple? Johansson describes them as a wonderfully warm, charismatic, and well-rounded couple, both individually and together. What did Channing Tatum say about the onset atmosphere? Tatum mentioned that the set was lively and fun, with his pranks and jokes fostering a sense of camaraderie among the cast. What role does Johansson's character play in the film? Johansson's character, Kelly Jones, is a marketing specialist hired to raise NASA's public profile and eventually tasked with staging a fake moon landing. How does director Greg Berlanti describe the chemistry between Tatum and Johansson? Berlanti praised their instant chemistry, which he believes is a key element of the movie's appeal. When is Fly Me to the Moon set to be released? The film is scheduled to be released on July 12th. In conclusion, Fly Me to the Moon brings together Channing Tatum and Scarlett Johansson in a charming romantic comedy set against the backdrop of the 1960s space race. Their playful interactions and mutual respect translate into compelling on-screen chemistry. The film's unique premise and historical context provide a fresh take on the genre, making it a must-watch this summer. For more details and behind-the-scenes insights, stay tuned to Use a Web Videos for the latest updates and reviews. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to stay informed about all things entertainment. Thank you for watching, and see you next time.